and as you mentioned that journey right from C to series A to series B especially as the organization also grows mm. uh, what do you see is the difference in the kind of leadership that is required at different stages and how have you seen leaders invest in their own development of uh, like journey, in, in the in their own journey as as a leader and growth so what have you observed yeah good question again we observed several things sometimes because for example we were still investor into nanobiotics which is a biotech french company incorporated in 2003 something like that we made the first investment in 2005 and they announced just before summer very big deal with johnson and johnson 2.5 billion euros a deal very happy to be a part, still part, small part, but still part of that. And we go through yeah. everything with nanobiotics and we, we made the first check. And then we have some discussion about what kind of, what could be the first product of the company. We also have some discussion about management because there, there was several founders at the beginning. And now the CEO is still the one of the founders, Laurent Lévy, but the, all the founders are not here, so it's part of your question. Sometimes the first casting is a good one, sometimes not. Sometimes you need to evolve during the time, and it's not so easy to do it. It's not so easy for the founders to accept it. It's not so easy for the investors to be aware that it's the good timing to make the evolution, and then it could also, could also be risky to, to change the management during the journey. But most of the time, you don't have the choice. And it's probably part of the things that we are looking at very carefully at the beginning. It's the quality of the management and their own ability to be, to listen to uh, voices and to be aware of the needs that they could have during the way and having the ability to hire people that are better than us, that are little than them, that are some kind of skills and experience, etc., to enrich the, the company. So it's probably the most important thing that we are looking at in the management team. And it's not so easy, in fact, to have it. And we can understand easily that entrepreneurs don't like to be the good people at one time and then not enough mature or evolve or a season to, to be the, the CEO for or to go to the end of the story. But it's part of our job. It's a big part of our job, to be honest. And then uh, we need to, uh, most of the time we are working with headhunters if we don't have people in our network and trying to match people together, it's not so easy. And sometimes it's very successful, sometimes less, 